What if someone asks you to create a certificate for 1,000 students or more? Are you going to input every single name one at a time or just simply cap and paste the entire list and finish the task in a short period of time? Well, this tutorial can help you finish the given task in a short period of time so just keep on watching and here are the things you needed and you have to prepare first is the name of the students you can copy this list of students from their advisors or teachers second you have to prepare a layout for the certificate and last one of course you will be needing a microsoft office application and should be installed in your laptop or computer so to start you have to create a new blank document in microsoft excel so this is where you're going to summarize the name of the students and once you're done for example i have here a blank document where i pasted all of the students the name of the students i am going to use in the certificate so let's say i have here 1074 students we are going to create a certificate for all of these ones to do that you have to open your microsoft publisher and open the layout you have prepared for the certificate but if you don't have layout you have prepared a design for you so go here over here we have award certificates click on this one and we have here some templates or designs you can use in your certificate so for me i will be using this one so click your desired certificate layout and then we have here the create button you click on this one and there you go we have here now our certificate of appreciation so in this name of recipient we can resize the size of the text to make it bigger so in this area here you can change the font style and you can also change the font size so i will be resizing this one into 28 and we are going to delete this text here so highlight the text and then backspace or delete so for us to insert all the names of the students we have to go to mailings and in this mail merge click on here and then we have here the step-by-step -step mail merge wizard So in the right corner of your window or screen, we have here publisher and the options you can follow to complete the mail merging. So in this create recipient list, if you have an existing list to use, you can select this one but if you don't have click on the type a new list and click the next create or connect to a recipient so once you click on this one there will be a pop-up window wherein you can write a title first name last name company name so you can also customize this columns to do that you have here the customize column click on this one and since we are going to use a complete name only i will rename title into complete name click ok and then we are going to delete the remaining columns
I'm now done deleting the remaining columns. So we have here only one column and click OK. So let's say I am going to write a name. Bernard James Cruz. And then after inserting a name, just click OK and you will be redirected to a my data sources this is the area where the file will be saved so i will name it as uh, names and then click save so just click ok and then go to next so we have here next create publication or we have here the previous create recipient list so we are going to insert the name in this text box so go to insert merge field and then click on complete name this is the merge field we have created earlier or the column click on this one and we have here now the name so if you want to view the names inserted in here just click on preview result so there you go this is the name i have added earlier and then let's go to the last step create merge publication so you can print the certificate you can print preview or you it's up to you so next step we are going to do is to insert the 1000 students 1000 name of students so go to documents where the file was saved so the that folder is my data sources where is that one go to my data sources there open this folder and we have here the names you open this one but before that one we have to close this publication so we just save this one under the certificate so we need a certificate 1000 students I will close this one first since we are going to edit this file here so open this one enable content So you can, since I am not going to use this name, you can highlight the entire column, go to Excel where you have saved the name of students. So you can highlight that one, copy and then go to, go back to names and then we are going to paste the names here. So just use the copy and paste and we have here notification where you're about to paste 1074 records are you sure you want to paste these records yes and we're done just click control save or control s to save the data and let's go back to our certificate certificate we have here our certificate do you want to open the publication yes so if you were to observe we have here the name and if you want to view the entire list of names just go to go to mailings and then we have preview result 
if you were to observe while we click on this one the names here are being changed so this will end up to until we reach 1074 since we have 1074 names of students so there starting from 1 until 1074 and if you're going to print this one try to observe file print so there we have one copies record print all records if you're going to print all records it will print the entire 1074 students so let's just finish the merge click on this area finish merge and merge to new publication merge to printer so it's up to you so this i will just click this or i will just save this certificate so from that you can create a thousand of certificates in just a few minutes by simply applying mailings and mail merge